The Spring Undergraduate Research Forum, better known as Surf Day, provides an annual showcase for all of the amazing research and creative endeavors that Elon students are pursuing. The Surf Day poster sessions are always popular, allowing attendees to easily browse a variety of research topics and directly engage with presenters. However, research also tells us that holding a large in-person gathering during a pandemic would be reckless. So we're taking it virtual. Poster sessions will happen on a platform called Gather, which sort of feels like an old school video game. You can access the poster sessions through a normal web browser. You don't have to install anything extra on your computer, but you will need to use a laptop or desktop computer with a keyboard rather than a mobile device. Just follow the Surf Day link to the poster session room at the designated time. You can enter your name and customize your avatar before entering the room. Presenters should write presenter before their name so they're easy to identify. This is also the screen where you'll select which camera and microphone to use. Just like a Zoom call, you'll want to make sure you have good lighting and a good angle for your video. And if you have headphones with a microphone built in, that will probably sound better than the mic that comes with your computer. You might get a pop-up message from your browser. Be sure to allow camera and audio access so that people can see and hear you. If you accidentally deny access to the camera or microphone, try closing out and reopening the link. If you haven't used Gather before, you'll start off in a demo room. You'll need to leave the demo before you can enter the poster session. Once you join the room, you can use the arrow keys on your keyboard to move up, down, left, and right. Unfortunately, a physical keyboard is required for this, which means you should not use your phone or tablet to join. In common areas, you can see and hear people who are close to you in a video chat window. This is very cool, but remember that you're here for the research. Try not to clog up the walkways chatting with your friends. There are a couple of bulletin boards near the center of the room showing the presentation list. Once you're close to a bulletin board, you can press X to open it up. Use the magnifying glass on the right to zoom in and out. You can also click and drag with your mouse to scroll. After closing out of the presentation list, you can actually zoom out using a keyboard shortcut to get a better view of how the room is laid out. Press Ctrl- on Windows or Command- on Mac to shrink everything. Then, press Ctrl or Command Plus to zoom back to normal. It should be pretty easy to find a poster based on the number, but if you're looking for a particular presenter, you can search for them. Click on the people icon from the left sidebar and search or scroll to find the name of the person you're looking for. Once you click their name, there's a button to locate them on the map, which will draw a line to them like a GPS. Once you enter the poster area, the carpet will change color to let you know that you're in a private space, meaning you can see and hear everyone else in that poster area. Try to keep yourself muted in the poster areas unless you're asking a question, so people can hear the presenter. You can mute and unmute yourself by clicking the microphone icon on your video thumbnail. The presenter should be standing by the bottom left edge of their poster, and they should have the word presenter in front of their name. When you're close enough to the poster, a preview image will show up in the bottom of your screen, and you can press X to view the poster. Again, the zoom buttons are on the right, and you click and drag with your mouse to see different parts of the poster. If you're in a crowded area and can't get through, you can use ghost mode. Hold down the G key to move through other people if you get trapped, and don't worry about memorizing everything. There are information booths set up with tips and reminders. Just get close and press X to open them up. There's also a help desk near the center of the room. Someone will be there the whole time to help with any questions or problems you may have. See you on Surf Day.